Break out the cheesesteaks and beer. We are live at Too Big to Fail Financial Stadium in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, home of the Evils. And this is a mean crowd, and they are looking for blood. Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The New London Patriots take on the Philadelphia Eagles. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If you like your cocktail cold, your soup hot, and your steak still moving, then you're going to love seeing mutants not cold, their brains turn into hot lava soup, and their bodies strewn about the field, lying still and barely moving. MFL game day is on the air. Oh, you just made me hungry, Grim. I'm going to go get some of them extra crispy mutant finger strips. Hey, get me a full slab of broken mutant ribs while you're there. Picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a, uh, <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. was there, but he still picked up a yard somehow. Second down and nine. Third down and the punter is warming up. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he put all of his foot into that one. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. a six-yard gain on that catch. And that'll be second down and four. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. And he's running like a moose right now. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. And he held on to that one for a first down. First down and one. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds. Mutant me. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is a 
unfortunate. And they line up for the extra point. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. And he's in into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he lives on to the raises. Like a two foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. Oh, with the punishing hit. And that'll bring him third down and inches. The teams are all tied up at the end of quarter one. We'll be right back. Third down and a pussy here. Shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. First and ten. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes 
goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. He picks up a two. And that'll be second and eight to go. He refuses to go down. Son of a bitch! The and the defense is on his heels. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. First and four. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmicks. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. and catch. Second down and six. And the quarterback is down. Zoom in on his face. I want to see if the little bastard's crying. Third down and long. for a second there. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is a time grim. That cross pitching, unbelievable. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this one. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? First and ten. Whoa, and he laterals the ball to the player behind him. Oh, he just got crushed. And it's first and ten. Take their first time out. Well, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out during halftime. And it's first and ten. 
for a couple of yards. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. And that'll be second and eight to go. Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. down and eight. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And out comes the most underrated position in football. The mighty punter. And he got an off. That's a decent punt. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. And it's first and ten. This guy's a brick shit house. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. Second and three. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. It's a tie game at the end of quarter two. The teams are deadlocked in a fierce struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, during the half, can you pick me up a soy like beer? And they're taking the field for the second half, and we have got a tie score. Uh, speaking of tie, Grim, me and Hot Wanda, we wanted to try something different, so we tied each other up the other night, and nothing happened because we were both tied up. I don't understand what the big deal is. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. And it's first and ten. And he punched his way out of that tackle. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. Boom out about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. It. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Grim. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. First and ten. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! <laughs> and they line up for the extra point.
When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. Pow! With the brain scrambler! And it's first and ten. Quibbling? It certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown! Touchdown! Try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, yeah like a so double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. <laughs> Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. One's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. Oh, mama! He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And that'll bring up second and one. I think the defenders are scared of this guy, Bricks, and they have every right to be. Yeah, he's a murderer! And it's first and ten. target more often. And it's first and ten. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done! And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. Love the sound of bones snapping and cracking. I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. Oh, oh, oh. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Oh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. First and ten. And that 
That's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Second down and two. when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made into dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> that was a good throw, and assuming he was aiming for the ground. Second down and ten. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Brick. It means he can return it for, you know what? Never mind. We're tied up at the end of the third quarter. You can smell the excitement on the fans. I mean, literally, it is ripe in here. Man. Junior, was that you? Hey, blow me. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Take the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole up here. Talking to you. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Third down and ten. And he picked up a lot of real estate in a hurry. Give him ten yards right there. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. the football first down and it's first and ten Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. Oh, with 
with the brutal hit. And it'll be second and eight to go. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. Straight through the uprights. <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. And that's a sack. Speaking of sacks, has anybody seen my powder? I'm itching like crazy over here. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. two-yard run before he stopped. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off-season. And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. I can't figure out who's more disappointed, the team, the coach, or the fans. Uh, how about your parents? And it's first and ten. way to keep the chains moving that was beautiful and that's two timeouts gone for the defense but they've really got to get the ball back to their offense but the offense is like 30 balls over there on the side i just wait for them why don't they just use them it's the ball boy he didn't do nothing he caught it and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone except maybe self but he seems to have worked through it. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond.
In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten, and that'll be their final timeout. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Quinn? Aren't we all? Oh, and the ball falls to the ground. That's incomplete. He needs to throw it when a receiver can catch it. What's he doing? And uh, groundbreaking analysis as always there, Bricks. Oh, thank you. I do my part. Oh, the defender just knocked the ball loose. Well, that'll wake you up. Then put you to sleep permanently. You snooze, you lose. Uh, unless you're in a sleeping contest. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, yeah like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. First and ten. Normally that would be a first down, but he had a whole lot of ground to make up. A home field loss for the Eagles. Man, that can't feel good, Junior. Yeah, I know the feeling. I've been married twice. They battled hard, but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chip chumps choking on a bag of chip dicks. Did you just say choking on a bag of chip dicks? Yeah. Yeah, that's beautiful. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...